Welcome to A State of Sight. I'm Isaac Porter from Lowry Porter Ophthalmology, and this is a special episode of A State of Sight for our patients who may have cataracts. I would like to explain what exactly cataracts are and what you could expect from your visit as we investigate the possibility of cataracts. You may know that a cataract is when the lens inside your eye starts to become cloudy, and the treatment for that is removing the cloudy lens and replacing it with a clear artificial lens implant by surgery. People who have cataracts may notice difficulty with their vision, particularly at night, when they are driving, when headlights are coming on, they may have trouble with glare. Other people may have trouble reading or seeing the TV, or they may have trouble in very bright light situations, or just a general blur or haze covering over their vision that cannot be corrected with glasses. If that's the case, we should be able to find out during an eye exam where first we will check to see what is the best vision that your eyes can see with special tests. Then we will check your vision with glare testing that can simulate bright lights shining onto your eyes, which can make the vision go down in some people that have cataracts. We will also take specialized mapping of the cornea or the clear shield that covers the front of the eye to know if there's any astigmatism or irregularity in the cornea that could be interfering with the vision. Astigmatism is when the cornea is not perfectly round and could have more of an uneven shape that could make the vision blurry. If it turns out that you do have cataracts, fortunately, modern surgery has advanced quite a bit to make this a very successful procedure. There are three choices for the lens implant that we put in at the time of surgery, and you may have a choice between these three lenses. The first lens is a standard lens implant with which we can correct a lot of the vision or include a lot of the power from the glasses or the contacts into the lens implant at the time of surgery. Because of this, many people can see better without their glasses than they could previously or they just need a smaller prescription in the glasses than they did before. They will still need bifocals or a pair of reading glasses in order to see up close since the lens implant will help their eyes focus primarily for distance. The second choice for a lens implant is what we call multifocal lens. This lens can give a full range of vision from up close to far away without the glasses and can give people the most freedom after the surgery from glasses or contacts. These lenses work best in people that have healthy eyes otherwise without macular degeneration or other problems with the vision. The third choice is for people who have astigmatism. They may qualify for a toric lens implant. This lens can correct the astigmatism of your eye at the same time as the cataract surgery and reduce the need for having correction for the astigmatism in glasses or contacts. If your eyes end up to have cataracts and they are interfering with your vision, we could schedule surgery to help remove the cataract and replace with artificial lens. We do one eye at a time. The second eye could be done as soon as two weeks after the first. If you have any other questions about cataracts, please post on our Facebook or we'll be happy to answer them on a visit into our office. So hope to see you soon. Until next time, good health and good sight.